guys so I thought I'd do something a little bit different today I wanted to show you guys our morning routine what Ava and I usually do every single morning so first thing I do is check my phone I know this is a super bad habit I'm trying to break it but I check my social media check my business emails so about half an hour later Ava's like screaming asking me to come get her so I go get her and we go and have breakfast Usually I give her a porridge or some wheat bix. She tends to like that, but sometimes she likes more dry cereals like toast and a bit of fruit. So I don't know, we try and do something different every now and again. And then I'm making her an avocado and banana smoothie. She loves these. These are one of her favorite smoothies. It's really simple. It's just some avocado banana milk, but these go down really well with her. And I have a bit of that as well. And so does her doll apparently. <laughs> So after breakfast, we usually play for a little bit. Here we're having a tea party on the kitchen floor. Mmm, tasty. <laughs> after that, Ava usually goes down for her nap and then I take the opportunity to clean the house and just kind of straighten everything out. So now it's time for mommy to get ready for the day. The first thing I do is brush my teeth. I've consistently been using this Sonic Toothbrush by Vanity Planet. I've been using it for a while now. I really love the way it works. It's got three different settings, which means you really get that deep, clean, I just went to the dentist feeling, which I love. Some electric toothbrushes on the market today can be quite pricey, but this one is actually really affordable. And to save even more, you can click the link down below in the description box and get 75% off. But the best part is it comes with a UV light sanitizer, which means it kills 99% of the germs that are on your brush, which is awesome. It's just a great feeling to know that every time you're brushing your teeth, it's completely clean. Then I usually have a shower and moisturize, do my skincare, and then start my makeup. But it's around this time that Ava wakes up from her morning nap. I then get her ready and then we start our day. morning guys so I hope you guys enjoyed Nikki's little get ready with me morning routine video people have been asking for one of those for a long time so I hope you guys liked it so we're just about to head to the cinema with a baby so we just found out about this cinema at Southland Shopping Center which is on the other side of Melbourne which has been made specifically for parents like us which is so cool apparently they have a playground in the middle of the cinema and all this other stuff to keep kids entertained and it's it's apparently one of those places where it's acceptable for your kid to be a little bit noisy because obviously we can't go to a regular cinema to watch a movie because we don't want to be those people disturbing everybody. So we're going to head down to this cinema. We're going to watch Sing, which is a, a movie that I think Ava's going to like because it's got heaps of music in it. And it's a movie that I've really been wanting to see as well. Ava, look at this. <laughs> you look excited already. Wow. Hey, that's so cool. They have kids snacks. Hey, how are you? They got a playroom. This little one has been a little bit restless in the movie. She was enjoying herself just a little bit too much. You were laughing a little bit too loud, weren't you? <laughs> she was just running all around the cinema and being really, really loud. So I thought maybe we'll have a little bit of a break. And now we're coloring in. This is Ava's artwork. You having fun? Okay. Show daddy how you draw. She is so hyperactive today. I don't know what got into her. That's so. 
You're just full of energy today. All right, so we're back in the cinema now. Ava, are you gonna behave yourself? The cool thing about this place is they actually have intermissions, and during the intermission, the kids can go down this really, really big slide. But Ava's a little bit small for it. How did we go? We did all right. But she did Yeah, yeah, we did all right. Ava, on the other hand, I don't know. I knew she wasn't going to sit. Having a bit too much. Fun. Yeah, I knew she wasn't going to sit still. But I kind of wishfully thought because it was a musical, she might watch it. I was I totally it wrong. For like two minutes. Yeah. And then she was like, okay, there's other stuff to do, other stuff to play with, other people to annoy. She kept trying to crawl up to other people and play with them. And Still their butt <laughs> Yeah. That was I, interesting. Yeah. It was a great setup all in all, though. She had fun. Though. Yeah, she did, she did have fun. We did. It was she stressful. Had she had the best time of her life. Uh, I think when she's three, we'll definitely be taking her back to this particular cinema, or a cinema in general. But yeah, we'll probably wait a while until we do that again. So we've just come down to my old school. We were in the area, so I figured might might as well just drop by. I wanted to show Mum and Ava where I used to play as a kid. This is where Mummy used to play, Avi. We used I can to have. Imagine you running around this. We used to have play, um, have softball practice right here. And Goy used to play cricket right here. And me and my friends would watch him on this ledge here and would get icy poles at this canteen and eat them behind here and be little rascals. <laughs> Even this thing is still here, but it didn't used to have the flowers on it. Dude, it's so crazy how like you can be away from somewhere for so many years and, and then all the memories here. come back Literally, as well, all yeah. These memories are flooding back, like me and my friends sitting on these stairs. Sitting under this oak tree. How big is that? It's pretty massive. I like your old school. It has a lot of character. No, it seriously does. They don't make schools like this anymore. I know, they look so modern. This just looks like a little country town school. But all this is new. They used to have a sand pit, but it didn't look like that. But yeah, we literally would sit under here. It's so funny, my friend. <laughs> We told so many stories under this tree and sat here with our little lunch boxes. Didn't you thought come to this school? No. Anyone I know come to this school? No. Ah, just me. There goes a the shoe. My best friend Kiri. so I can get her face. <laughs> Hi. She said, oh. this is too slow. I, I can get out and walk faster than this. Oh, well then go ahead and do it then, honey. We want to see you do it. <laughs> go on. Hey. hey. She's like, daddy. daddy. Where's daddy? Uh, are you going uh. to push your car like you were doing before? Can push you your push car. It? Can you push it with daddy? Wow. Wait, Did your car wait, break wait, down? Wait, wait. I won't fit in. No, you won't fit in. She's uh, confused. She's like, wait, you're supposed to push me. <laughs> Look she's like, get out the way. <laughs> she like, literally no. pushed you out of the way. This girl, I swear. She's <laughs> Look at her face too. Oh she looks like she's about to like steal it. She was so mad that I got in there. She's like, what? <laughs> you gonna push it? <laughs> Can you give Louie a ride? 
<laughs> he's like, he's in my car. <laughs> What's he doing in your car? <laughs> okay, push him. Push him. Give him a ride. Give him a ride. <laughs> <laughs> Come on, give him a push. Give him a push. Oh, go Ava. That is the cutest thing in the world. <laughs> this is the cutest thing ever. <laughs> He's like, I'll do this just for you. <laughs> She's so excited. Good boy, Louie. You're a good sport. Well, Nikki's just trying to put Ava down to sleep. She is not wanting to go down to sleep. There has been way too much excitement in this house tonight, and she is really worried that she's going to miss out on something if she goes to sleep. So hopefully 